What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Halloween special. It's about to get spooky, y'all. Huh? <laughs> it's actually hella late. Not hella, but it's 10 o'clock at night, and we're about to paint some pumpkins. Selena came through with some mini pumpkins for us to paint, so that's what we're gonna be doing. We actually have a few. We have three mini ones, and then we also have like this size one. So we're just gonna go ahead and go in. I have some questions that I'm gonna be asking for us while we paint, and we'll see who has the best pumpkin at the end. You guys will vote. So I wish I could have showed you guys the ones that we painted last time, but Selena's is already got molded and <laughs> got thrown in the trash because she carved hers. Mine still isn't carved yet, so it's still like painted, but I have an idea of what I'm gonna do for these. I just don't know what I'm gonna do for this one yet. Do you know what you're gonna do? Mm. For all of them? Kinda, yeah. What the? Okay. I hope we're not doing the same thing. I doubt it though, but we'll see. Oh, can you get a blow dryer? This one. The blow dryer? <laughs> Girl. <laughs> Alright, we got the blow dryer because we, we're gonna need some quick drying on these so that way we can like kind of speed up the process a little bit. Okay, so first question. It's gonna be like fun questions. They're actually gonna be random. So if you guys have specific questions that you want me to ask next time, just leave them down below. And we'll do another video where I'll like ask your guys' questions. All right, so first question. If you could meet anyone in the world, alive or dead, who would it be? That's a good question. person in your mind like even if they're alive or dead no it doesn't have to be someone that like someone that you've always wanted to meet or like someone that you would be like kind of yeah. starstruck if you met them huh? i said adam sandler adam sandler yeah. i would want to meet him too big daddy's one of my favorite movies what's your favorite movie from him mm -hmm. they're all funny i like how he does his own he produces them. You didn't answer. Oh yeah, me, I would pick maybe honestly Tupac. Mm -hmm. Just cause his music is hella deep. And I don't know, I just want I would kinda wanna pick his brain a little bit. Cause it seemed like he knew a lot mm -hmm. for his time. So I don't know. Maybe he would like tell me a secret. <laughs> Like, you know, maybe, I don't know. I'll find something out that I didn't know before. Oh, this is a good one. Who would you, pl who would play you in a movie? Me? Like who, yeah, like say there was a movie about our family and we had to pick like, who would play you in the movie? Mm. Like you have a actress or, you know, somebody that you would want to play you? No. I feel like I know. Who? But they're not like a real person. It's like a cartoon, oh. <laughs> but like for some reason that character comes to my head. Who could I think of? For Selena? I don't know. I don't really have a lot of like actresses that I'm yeah, like... I don't it's kind of hard. I honestly, I wouldn't know who. I would pick maybe for me like somebody cool like Eva Mendez or something because she's been in a lot of like gangster movies like she's usually like that girl I feel like I would pick her for me for Selena I don't know I was thinking the girl from Bob's Burgers which one? the girl with the hat, the hat. yeah because she's just always saying like shit that you're like bro That one's good. Don't worry, don't worry. It looks weird right now. It looks weird, trust me. But when I'm done, you guys are gonna be like, wow, cat. Are you making donuts? <laughs> are you? Yeah. <laughs> it kind of looks like it already, right? Well, nothing else is brown on top and just halfway, so. Yeah. 
It does look like a donut. <laughs> She got the ghost pumpkin over there. So she basically, you want to tell them why you start off white? Oh, because the orange like overpowers on the, on the other colors. So she uses white as her base. So that's why her whole pumpkin is white. Where is your dream place to visit? The UK. The UK? Mm -hmm. Why? Because that's where they filmed Harry Potter. Oh, I didn't even know that. I like everything just seems cool. Like there's there's a lot of stuff to do. Like it's a brand new city. Yeah, I want to go to the UK too. And like hear their accents. Would you like some water? Yeah, like I would just be like yes. No. <laughs> I would ask them questions just to hear their voice. Okay, the UK. I think for me, I would say Egypt. Because I want to see the pyramids. What is your love language? Like for me to other people or people to me? Um, I guess both. Oh. <clears throat> I don't really know what that means. What that question means. <laughs> it just says what is your love language? Like for I'm gonna go first. So for me, I would say mine receiving, I think that's what it's called, your receiving love language is mine is words of affirmation for sure. And um, what else is the other ones? I don't even know all of them. Supposedly there's a test you can take. Maybe we should take that test. Oh, I did that. But that's like the one of like you, like for what other you people? need from other people. Oh, uh, what did it say? Mine? Yeah. It said gifts. <laughs> Material girl! <laughs> I mean, it kind of makes sense though. Yeah, I could see that you're like, you like gifts. Uh, I like gifts too, but I feel like for me, words hit stronger. I feel like no, not words because of how much they hit strong. I don't know how to react. Uh, so like, you, it makes you uncomfortable. Yeah. Yeah. Or I'd be like, that's hella corny. <laughs> Do you have a hidden talent? Ooh, that's a good one. No. Like something that nobody knows that you can do or like, I don't know, maybe something that you like are interested in that like nobody knows. Or something you would want to learn that nobody would want to learn. Yeah, like. Play piano. Okay. You got a keyboard right there. <laughs> it hasn't been being used. Oh, the, oh, this is a good question. Do you, you didn't even answer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I'm getting to. What was the question? Hidden talent? Oh, hidden talent. Do I have a hidden talent? Um, I'm psychic. I feel like I am too. Yeah, I'm psychic. It's not like, no, like I have dreams and like they come like to real life, but it's not like tomorrow type things. Like, yeah, like ways. yeah, no, yeah, that's happened to me too. Yeah, like but it happens to me like a lot. It's like, not like something where I could be like, oh, I'm gonna go into the future and tell, but like sometimes it comes to me. Okay, another question: Do you believe in God or a higher power? I was talking about this one in there. Um, I feel like. Yeah, I guess, but I just need proof. <laughs> well, like, what, you want to see him in real life? or I want proof that he's here, not a Bible, not a book. Anybody can lie. And there's so many different versions of the Bible. It's like... I think there's like simplified versions of the Bible. But... Example... I mean, proof. Example of proof? I don't know. I want proof. Like... I need a no. But like, paper but like, how much proof? Like, do you need like to see it physically or like just like feel it? Cause like, no. I feel like some people like feel his presence. You know, sometimes or like, if you I talk feel to like God, I'm being or watched. Something. All the time. <laughs> being watched. I think I'm just cause I'm scared of ghosts. <laughs> or maybe, okay. How about, okay, cause being watched means like uncomfortable you know but like do you feel like you're protected from what just from like things like no like have you ever noticed like 
like for example for me when i was like in um, elementary school this was something that i noticed when i was really young every year in since elementary school i got blessed with the best teacher every year i had the best teacher of that grade i never had like you know like you know just like those teachers i never got them like i was always so lucky like my cousin would always end up and we have the same last name y'all so i always thought it was so weird that like we could have pretty much ended up in the same classes or like you know what i mean mm -hmm. but he always got put into like the shitty teacher and i always noticed so i always felt like i was protected in a way because i always felt like well obviously god is the one that's like putting these people in my life you know <laughs> so that's what i meant like do you ever feel like you're like being guided or something like intuition or i don't know what to do for this one I hate to go over those i know i'm gonna go over them i'm just letting them dry a little bit i think this brown one's starting to dry up so your answer no no but you believe in god you just want proof yeah okay. but you believe so <laughs> that was the question um what's oh this is a good question what's the social or political cause you're most passionate about like is there something that you can think of no <laughs> Really? Not I know, like, I know. Well, hunger, like yeah. homelessness, I like, like war. If it got nothing to do with me, then it's like, if, it don't, if, like, if I'm not dying because of it, like, if that, that's not the reason why I died. But do you ever feel bad for people? That, oh, yeah, like, I feel bad, but it's like, there's really nothing I can do about it. Like, what about political? Are you into politics and no. things like that? Like, yeah, I haven't really been either, honestly. I try to be, but... Yeah, it just doesn't interest me. And I feel like it's just a way to divide people even more. Oh, I meant to like, the, like us going backwards in time. Us going backwards? Like repeating things? Not repeating. Yeah, I guess, yeah. Like undoing all the things that we did. Like with the government. Yeah. You don't want to do that? You would want to do that? No, something that, like I'm passionate about, like, like that. Like, I believe that we're going back in time. Like everything that we're doing is like wrong. Mm. Like you know, all the things getting like, like reversed. Like yeah, we have all these amendments and and things are history is still repeating itself. Mm. Yeah, I get you. It's an ongoing cycle. It's never gonna stop. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm. I'm on uh, like on the internet. I'm just looking at questions to ask you guys. These aren't questions that like anybody asks. They're like, who asks these questions? <laughs> A song or movie scene makes you cry without fail. Oh, um, man, she was quick with that one. I know because the thing that makes me cry so easily is like dogs dying, like. Oh, uh, what's so, that? What's that one movie? You know the one with, like it's like that one white girl with the blonde hair and like they get a dog. Marley and me. Yeah, that movie makes me like cry like to the point like, I can't breathe. <laughs> yeah, the dog ends up. What happens to the dog? The dog dies of old age. Oh, uh, I'm like oh, <laughs> I thought something happened to it. No, but it's like it's so sad because you see it like grow up and like yeah. with the kids and it's like the kids don't know how to comprehend. Like I always feel bad. Like I start crying. Oh, every single time. So Marley and me. Yeah. That's why I hate watching that movie, but I love that movie. Like, I'm following our stars. Oh yeah, following our stars. I like that movie too. I think for me, I like. I think romantic movies make me cry. So like, The Notebook always. I don't care how many times I've watched it. I don't <laughs> it makes always me cry. laugh. It makes me cry. <laughs> it makes me laugh. Yeah, okay, I have another question. Would you allow me to do your makeup in a blindfold? <laughs> in a blindfold? Yeah, like, like I'm, my I'm, routine? I'm blindfolded and I have to do your makeup like, for you. But like, oh, my... you got white paint on you. And like, like, I have to try to find your eyebrows. But like, my routine? I guess it would be my routine on you. <laughs> Whatever I do. I got my lip. Your makeup routine? Or just like let me do a makeup 
look. But if it's mine, mine is like so easy. Like, yeah, but if I was blindfolded, it wouldn't. Would you let me do your makeup blindfolded? That's the question. Doesn't matter what. Yeah, if it's mine. If it's your routine? Yeah. Okay. You can't mess up my routine, really. Like, but if I'm blindfolded, bro, like, right now, literally, I, look. I have, I have a brush. I have to try to find your face right now. And but I have like, to try to eyeshadow. find your eye. And I don't wear eyeshadow. That's why I'm like, oh, like, it's easy. Okay, like, but this is like eyebrow brush. So this would kind of be like This eyebrow. is fine. Like, you could just feel my face and you won't feel the eyebrow. Damn, that would be kind of hard. Yo, comment down below if y'all want to see that so we could do that next. Because that would actually be a good video to watch. What's something that you find funny about our parents? My dad's jokes are not funny and it's so awkward that it's just so funny. Like, oh yeah, I know my dad's jokes are really not funny. <laughs> but it's like so awkward that it's funny like when he tries to be funny. Mom, she's just like so blunt like <laughs> she's like me for real. Yeah, that is just funny because you're just like what am? Yeah. You got no filter. I would say the same thing, honestly. <laughs> dad's jokes are like not funny. I know. I don't know what I- I was just gonna say that they're weird. <laughs> <laughs> who do you think is the favorite child? For who? Depends for who. For both. For both? I think for mom. For mom, I think it's either Mary or you. And for dad? Definitely not me. <laughs> um, I say... Say Anthony, I guess. Or Ryan. Yeah, I would say Ryan. For dad, I would say Ryan. And for mom, I would say Ryan. <laughs> but maybe me for my mom. Yeah, probably both of us. It's a tie. What do you like most about our grandparents? That's a good question. <coughs> How nice they are. Even though like, we barely see them. Like, for mom or dad? Who are you talking about? For both. Oh, and, oh, well, for mom and, for mom, I would say, like, how funny they are. Like, our papa is, like, hella funny. Like, yeah, that's true. He'll be making jokes. And from dad, I would say, like, how caring they are. Um, me, I would say, like, most, their food. I like my grandma's food. On my dad's side, she makes really good gorditas and. She does. Her food is always like the best. So definitely that. My grandpa, I like that he would always, he's always like, Karin, Karin. Like, <laughs> I just think it's so funny. Like he made his own little nickname for me. He's just like that. Yeah. Like, he just like the yeah. jokes like, that they make. Like, they just try to, all funny. <laughs> they try to make things funny, you know? Like they're, they're that type of person though. Like they like to make people laugh and things like that. I like that. And for my mom's side, uh, my grandma, the only thing I really remember about my grandma is like when I was little, I remember coloring with her. Like, I don't know if it was one specific day or if this happened multiple times, but I just remember sitting down and we would color. And she really liked to color and I like to color. Like, I feel like whenever I try to color with kids, like they're over it, you know, like they'll color for a little bit and then they're done. But like, I could color with her for hella long. And that was like a way that we like bonded because we wouldn't really talk. Like we would literally just be there color, you know, and then she would just show me hers after or whatever. Like, I don't really remember conversations really. And my grandpa on my mom's side. Um, I don't know. I like that he's loving and he gives like a sense of comfort when you're around him, you know, like you could sit on his lap, which I feel like I don't do that to any of my grandpas, you know, like, I mean, you only have two. Yeah, true. But like my other grandpa, I don't have that kind of relationship with him where I like sit on his lap and hug him, you know, and like, but my grandpa on my mom's side, it's different like I have that kind of relationship with him where I could sit on his lap and give him a kiss and hug him and it doesn't feel weird or awkward you know um, so yeah that's what I was saying probably gonna finish um, a few more questions and then we'll like come back and show you guys the end result pretty much because I don't know if I got this many questions and <laughs> she's gonna think in a while so drawing like I know, but that's because, yeah, she goes, look at me. I just did 
a face on the orange. She would have painted this whole thing white, and did the whole thing a different color, and added the Odin skin tone. Yeah. <laughs> look at mine. It's going out so cute. Does that not look like a donut? I don't even try to eat that right now. Why is it focused on your face? <laughs> yeah, that looks so freaking cute. But that's basically what I'm gonna do to finish off like the rest of mine. I'm just gonna add sprinkles and then you guys will see what I do with this guy. But that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys learned a little bit more about me and my sister. Let me know if you guys want to see us do some more videos together. Comment down below any questions or anything like that. I hope you guys have a safe Halloween. Don't be drinking and driving. Selena's gonna be Harry Potter, so if y'all see her out catching spells on people, I'm gonna have a <laughs> oh, we gonna have to make you one. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll come back and I'll show you guys the final results. But appreciate you guys. We'll see y'all in the next one. We got. The donuts with the donut monster versus the Pokemon. So oh, you should move that one a little bit more to the right. Yeah. And Gengar. Gengar. <laughs> Gengar, sorry. That was Gengar. Okay, so you guys have to vote and you guys can see my other one in the back and Trippy's unfinished one in the back. <laughs> You guys are going to go with number one or number two? Comment down below. All right, go with number one. I think number no, one. Pick number my one, pumpkin. my lord. Oh, this is the one my sister did. If you guys know, do you have a picture of the other thing? That's what it looks like when it's lit up. Okay, that one was good. That one was good. But I think I won this one.